Hi guys, welcome to this video about the message on Amazon. You must be in good standing in the Amazon community to post. So what might have happened if you see this message? This usually happens when you ask or when you try to ask a question. So when you have a product like here, uh, here I have this uh, smartwatch and I want to ask a question about the camera to which uh, direction it points, if it points up or forward or, or, or what else. So usually you go down then on Amazon and there's a section which uh, is called have a question and you can type in something and it starts to retrieve any question uh, any answer about that and yeah uh, matching answer and if it doesn't if you don't find the answer that there's a button then underneath ask question to community and then usually you, you can answer uh, I mean the, the question will be uh, sent to all the buyers or all the reviewers I, I, I'm, not, I, I'm not sure about that and they can answer this and so that's always helpful but sometimes you just get this information you must be in good standing in the Amazon community to post so I've been talking to Amazon what has happened because I'm not a spammer, I'm not a scammer, I just try to be honest, try to give honest feedbacks, everything and now I see this uh, strange message it was uh, really bothering me and I, I was talking to the Amazon support and they tried to figure out what happened and they couldn't give me a 100% answer but um, they were uh, suspecting that I was trying to send same question for several or multiple products and I had to agree that, yeah, I did that. Um, I can't exactly remember what it was about. Maybe it was the hemp oil which I was ordering. So I, it's always a big question if they contain uh, H, uh, HCC or something like that uh, or, or CBD and, and those uh, things and um, yeah so sometimes it, it's not in the listing they don't list they don't say it in the listing so <coughs> sorry about that so sometimes you just learn it when you um, when you get the product sometimes it has in the packaging it has an additional information and then you see what you get so sometimes it's not in the listing and and and, and i think it's um it should be allowed to ask this question i mean when you're interested in maybe two or three different products i mean types for uh, yeah like let's say si same thing let's say the um hemp oil uh, is provided by like five uh, manufacturers uh, five resellers or whatever I mean not same product but a little bit different product and you want to ask you, you want to find the real the, the right product with, which fits for your need and then you have to ask same question to uh, different products and uh, I think this is a, a, a legit um, thing and this is not spamming I, I, I mean I, I wasn't doing this on a daily basis it was just I think once in four years or something uh, like that and they immediately um, revoked my uh, possibility to ask questions to the community this is, is a really bad thing and uh, I, I think Amazon is uh, w when they continue with, with this they they will go down they have to go down I've heard such complaints from other people's uh, they're coming up more and more they uh, overestimate their position they think Amazon they are the only seller in the whole world but um, 
there will be competition upcoming and a lot of people are so mad about Amazon in the meantime also a lot of sellers uh, because Amazon is doing uh, uh, putting a lot of pressure on resellers and, and, and so on so on the long term, uh, term I think Amazon will lose the only uh, the only reason why uh, a lot of uh, sellers and buyers are staying with Amazon because there's no no alternate um, yeah solution for that and as soon as somebody steps in and provides same uh, same service same products same price say they, they will be out of the market uh, Amazon has been so so bad uh, it's it, it, it's it's crazy a lot of people uh, hate Amazon it's I mean it was a really good uh, company and but now they are getting worse and worse and worse and they delete everything they revoke rights they do things without uh, give you a reason for that or uh, without give you a, an, a heads up or without giving you the opportunity to appeal for something like that that's it's really a bad thing and uh, yeah so I cannot guarantee if this is the 100% solution or, or reason so if you have if you're in the same situation the only way is to go down I mean to 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 uh, get rid of this uh, I mean the thing is yeah uh, you, you still can ask questions I mean you can or you can uh, sorry I have to <laughs> say this in another way you have to look you still can look up for answers let's say you can look you can write here uh, I mean it's a bad thing because it has uh, zero feedbacks but of course let's go to another product so here I'm on the LTV 30 and so I can type like uh, when I was look uh, when I let's say I'm looking for the carrier which is supported like T-Mobile yeah something like that and you will find predefined like answers or questions which were already uh, yeah, uh, made and you can find this but you cannot uh, ask the question here when I click on ask the community same silly thing will come that you must be in good standing in the Amazon community so you can still look for answers but you cannot uh, make additional uh, questions so what, what you have to do uh, if you want to appeal I mean I think the chance is not really good that they will um, they, they they will set you back so you will be able to uh, make questions again but the only thing is to talk to an Amazon rep and here go down click on help and it, it's sometimes a little bit difficult to get to this thing I think you have to go to let me find this thing there is something yeah I think it was yeah need more help and then co click on contact us and then you click on prime something else and so on and so on and yeah you go through the whole thing and at the end you can chat to them so uh, yeah that's the thing which you which you can do and um, yeah hopefully they will set this restri reset this restriction but uh, based on my experience chance is not really really good that you will succeed they are not interested anymore I mean uh, the Bezos the owner of Amazon is, ju is the richest guy in the whole world in meantime and um, the Amazon is still one of the most successful companies and they have no reason to listen to customers at least at the moment but they would be happy maybe in five years if they had listened but yeah then probably it will be too late so anyway uh, that's it for now I hope I was able to help you a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time